वेलकम गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल अध्ययन विद फ्लो नाउ गाइस वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस दो स्पीशीज हु डज नॉट कंटेन जोस लाइक साइक्लोस स्टमला वी कंप्लीट दिस थिंग पाइसिस वी ऑलरेडी डन दिस थिंग इन आवर प्रीवियस वीडियो नाउ नाउ द फिश पार्ट इज कंप्लीट पाइसिस दिस पार्ट इज कंप्लीट and now we will switch towards the what tetrapods guys they bear what they bear limbs four limbs means hand and hind limbs means legs four limbs means heads hands and hind limb means leg that's it first of all let's discuss about amphibia then reptilia avs and mammals okay let's start with we already done this thing cyclostoma chondrichthyes ऑस्ट्रिकथीज नाउ लेट्स मूव टूवर्ड्स द एम्फीबियंस नाउ का स्पेशल फीचर ऑफ एम्फीबियंस इन्स एम्फी मीन्स ड्यूअल लाइफ मीन्स दे लिव ऑन टेरिस्टियल एज वेल एज अक्वाटिक दैट्स वाई दे कॉल इट एज वॉट एम्फीबियंस नाउ दे आर बॉडी डिवाइडेड इन टू हैड ट्रंक गाइज दे ऑल्सो कंटेन वॉट टिम्पेन मीन्स दे कैन हीयर टिम्पेनम प्रजेंट्स is indicate that they can hear because they work as a ear guys their outer skin maximum amphibians maximum amphibians like salamander rana means frog what guys they have special kind of scales they have special kind of skin moist skin because we know na guys they live on terrestrial as well as aquatic medium as well as aquatic medium now guys they have well elaborate alimentary canal excretory system reproductive system nervous system definitely heart circulatory system they can respire because they have respiratory system in water they respire by gills like fishes like kin but on the terrestrial part they respire through the lungs as well as skin that's why their skin is moist the heart is three chambered means two auricle and one ventricle that's it sexes are separated guys these are not a, a paragraph writing you make a point give such a heading and draw 1.2 3 make a 10 to 15 points about amphibian then your examiner will give you full marks but after 10 and 20 points formation this is not enough okay you have to draw a diagram you have to write down a uh, examples then they give you full out of full marks otherwise they don't give you okay uh, write a discipline manner these are what these are not a paragraph these each point is important each point is important and make a pointing make a points make a points not write like in this manner they are oviparous what is you what thing is understand what you understand by oviparous guys they release egg and development is indirect what is the meaning of indirect means they have larval stage guys we know now frog have larval stage the name of the their larva is what what guys tadpole and they do into metamorphosis meta morphosis guys metamorphosis is not a easy process this is not a easy process guys multiple hormone will take participate in this procedure and then they become young and adult frog guys here is many examples of amphibians like first is toad frog maximum look at here maximum frog species this is the salamander guys this species is very important if i cut now their limb if i cut this limb they can regenerate their limb yes guys they can regenerate their limb this process is called as a epimorphogenesis no one tells you but i tell you that this process is epimorphogenesis if i cut this limb if i cut this limb they can regenerate they can regenerate their limb in 3 to 7 days they also take more okay this phenomena is epimorphogenesis and previously i told you know that hydra about hydra and about plain area guys if i cut hydra into multiple pieces if i cut plain area into multiple pieces they also regenerate their cells but they are complete 
uh, look at me guys if i cut this part now if i cut this part they can again form a complete body but here i cut this limb so they make limbs only they don't make a full salamander no if i cut this limb then they regenerate their limbs so this phenomena is apimorphosis but in the case of hydra planaria what happen if i cut this small portion they make a complete hydra they make a complete hydra if i cut this portion if i cut this portion they make a full of the full planaria so this phenomena we call it as a morpho laxis no one tells you guys this is important that's why i tell you in your neat examination this point is arise now the time for this point guys this is the example limbless amphibians right okay guys now let's move towards the our next class reptilia look at here there is you are familiar with these examples okay you are not feel like a strain this is about chameleon what is the property of chameleon they have camouflage property hide their self hide their self according to environment yes they can change their color chameleon this is the crocodile they have four chambered heart tortoise chameleon and naza 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 king cobra guys what is the feature of reptiles guys this is the main property of reptiles creeping and crawling mode of locomotion this is the property of maximum reptiles they perform this feature they movement they locomote by creeping and crawling creeping and crawling creeping and crawling guys they are mostly terrestrial according to amphibians they are terrestrial as well as they are aquatic but reptiles they are mainly terrestrial next point is guys their skin is very dry, uh, dry and cornified skin cornified skin like these crocodile have cornified skins corn rigid and maximum they have very dry skin guys special feature of uh, snack is what they release their skin they release their skin you know guys in a winter time in a summer time we also feel this same feature that uh, our white whitish skin is uh, dry out okay they can appear if we don't use any kind of lotions then we easily can visualize this dry skin so guys they also have dry skin and they release their skin if this snake is here so they can release their skin they can release their skin this is a skin guys they do not have external ear opening so guys they can't hear but tympanum ribs present ear guys maximum they have tympanum ear guys in a special feature of snake is what they can't hear they can't listen but they can't sense sorry sorry they can sense a snake what a feature of snake is they can sense what what vibration anyone can walk running they can sense yes ki anybody is here anyone is here someone is here guys limbs when present if limbs is present like tortoises have limbs like crocodile have limbs chameleon have limbs but they have little bit small uh, small legs these are the four limb and these are the hind limb these are the four limb these are the hind limb these are the four limb and these are the hind limb but snake does not contain any kind of legs all right or not guys this one this so uh, sorry, sorry wait 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 this one this one and this one these three all are all reptiles contain three chambered heart except crocodile that's it that's it guys that's it so guys all reptilia contain what three chambered heart they have three chambered heart they also have three chambered heart they also have three chambered heart but crocodile only 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 crocodile have four chambered heart guys next point is what this is important okay three chambered heart but uh, except crocodiles guys reptilians are poikilotherms guys what is the meaning of poikilotherms guys meaning of poikilotherms is what can't regulate their temperature now guys snake and lizard share their scale as skin cast i already explained this thing they can release their skin okay sexes are separated fertilizers in internal they are oviparous means they release what they release ov means egg ova egg development is direct they does not have any kind of larva stage guys these are the example of reptiles these are the examples of reptiles because of this nature na 
creeping and crawling they reduce their leg use they reduce their use of leg so they can become short shorter and shorter and shorter and shorter okay there is example of turtle tortoise tree lizard garden lizard crocodiles okay alligator wall lizard poisonous snake like naza naza cobra bangaras and vipers more highly toxic vipers highly toxic yeah cobra is also toxic but yeah viper is so toxic okay guys that's all for now okay that's all for now the complete amphibia you have to write in one by one make a heading uh, draw uh, write down 10 to 15 points with label diagram and examples same thing is here make a heading of reptilia make a 10 to 15 points this is the guys minimum criteria 10 to 15 points diagram and examples clear guys in our next video we complete what avs and what guys mammalia okay this is long now okay so we will meet in our next video so guys that's all for now thank you so much thank you so so much and keep supporting me revise revise and revise guys if you revise then you can secure your rank thank you guys thank you for listening to me and don't forget to subscribe and share my channel thank you so much